There's been a lot of talk about flooding, and now it's time for some action in Georgetown. The city has an action plan that includes $350 million worth of projects. The city cannot afford them all, so a public hearing tonight will fill in the community on their priorities. KXing's Lauren Kravitz shows us some of those solutions. It was coming down the streets, all the streets, and it was coming right here. And the water was up to my husband's knee. Evelyn Ranum remembers the flood tropical storm Hermine rushed to her doorstep. The watermark still etched in her garage eight years later. The carpet, everything had, the floor had to be all changed. Ranum lives in Smith Branch on the southeast side of Georgetown, the city's top priority to prevent future flooding. If there's some things that we can do to minimize, minimize the effect of those floods, then we want to do that. So neighbors don't have to worry. And I get a shovel and try to take the dirt out so that the water runs. The city has a list of 62 proposed projects to fix flooding problems. They've already made some improvements, like here near another part of Smith Branch Creek. This is an existing culvert that was here, and because we had, you know, experienced uh, flooding here in the past, uh, this uh, culvert was expanded. Other solutions include raising bridges, creating retention ponds, and buying out properties. Look at all the buildup over there. You see all that timber? Evelyn says something as simple as cleaning out the creek could help keep their homes dry. We had comforters here. Lauren Kravitz, KXAN News. Georgetown's top 10 priority list would cost $20 million. They'll look at their budget every year and possibly other revenue sources like the county, TxDOT, and FEMA. To see more of these improvements, you can head over to the Georgetown Municipal Complex. That meeting starts at 6 o'clock tonight.